use their own version of words to say things that might sound like they're different, no, but that man. might just no, be man. essentially the same. If you use, words them, I use like a while ago and you say you have the plant, then, which is everything that the earth is from plant consciousness. You get me? You even have but a word like the plant might be a easier concept than a word like Christ. Because you talk about Christ, yeah, you raise yeah, a yeah, like but I mean, Christ, you can look on it however, <laughs> like you can look on it however you want to look on it, like you can look on it however you want to look on it, even if you want to go letter by letter by letter by yeah. letter. And this is, where, this is where we fail a lot of the times when we are dealing with community, right? Yes, we fail yes. to understand that yes. we want to be overstood. <laughs> If we want people yeah. to truly know me, otherwise yeah. stay well, you know, in the you know this, you know this, you, know, you see, you, you see, you see. No, no, is no is a definitive moment. You know? There's no yeah. one from your community who would misunderstand your using of the term Christ. But I have you that anyone there is who the, anyone who would have looked upon you and me over well, time, anyone who would have looked upon you and me with compassion for who we are. Well, on, look, well on. if you don't, if you can't look for me with compassion, you know, yeah, you know, from the same the community. Say what again? are the blockages of compassion? Misunderstanding, emotional yeah. trauma. So yeah. you may be well on your way to yeah. wanting to express compassion, and because you are mm. triggered, you lose focus of the compassion you are trying to build. And now you have said something, and I can no longer hear you. It's like when yeah. two people are in, when man and woman mm. are in love. Yeah, and you you have a disagreement. Me who yeah. used to see I you every day, all of a sudden yeah. I can't hear you. And it's like yeah. when you don't understand me, and the two people are yeah. there. There are people who love each other, there, but they literally cannot hear each other. And yeah, words when, don't when, mean. When, uh, can I say something? Depending on it, you're can in. I say something? A religion is a strikes people on a very emotional, potentially traumatic level. So this is why, like for me. You will not hear me speak about certain things in a social media context. But if me and you reasoning, and I understand yeah. because this is me reasoning. So yeah. the way we are will be different from how you would talk if you were talking to somebody else. But no, my responsibility as your sister, right, as the feminine present, is to have a broader sense of what compassion means. Meaning, even the words I say. I will, I will literally censor myself. And censor means use my senses, all of my senses, to determine how do I say, what do I say, and what do I not say for the benefit of the broader conversation. You know? And so a concept like when we mention certain concepts, we have to pause and put a disclaimer there to say, listen, we are talking about concepts and symbols. When you break down the etymology of words, you understand it. His majesty was a... His, education minister him choose to be of all the things him could have been because he understood the importance and value of the word this man make sure that him write him own biography so nobody could misinterpret what him trying to say to the world he spoke softly and he spoke eloquently in multiple languages and he was not ever raising his voice this is a man who you had to be quiet to hear what he was saying you know what I mean? So we know when we are distributing information, this is a man who had the level of knowledge because there are some books that His Majesty wrote that not everybody has access to. These books are out of publishing. Some of them have been destroyed. This, His Majesty wrote books on etymology and talking about how words can be broken down. So when you're looking at a man like that, you understand the importance of communication. And there's a way that we deal with language within the Rastafari culture where you can't, the way you say it, it's not that we try, you know what I mean? It's like, you can't, you, mm. we, we don't use, we don't use the word ja. We use I. Why? Because of ja represents and the letter J was not created until this time. And so Jesus, and you know, we can go into these things and we can go down a rabbit hole of what they mean. Right? And we can oh, then we can, go oh, into, so let, the way we can I, let word, we can let words we can allow words to arise, you know, as symbols and images and watch it like all your art. When you watch a movie, right, you think the man you write the movie, I try to say what the what go on in the movie. No. He use the things that were going on in the movie to communicate a bigger message like 
don't bite the hands that feed you, the stone that the builder refused. These are the small things that a, a whole movie is trying to communicate. You know? So the same thing when someone I have a conversation what? and if 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 I have to use if I have to use X Y Z amounts of words, and this when even when time use the word price, it's these level of understand like some someone we can listen to someone and chat about bag of things, and in the end, regardless of all the bag of things that the man say and do, you, you, at least you get the point when did I say? At least you get you leave with an understanding of saying yo. This man, him come and him use a bag of words and whatever, but in the end, he was saying, the stone that the builder refused will always be dead kind of stone. In the end, he was saying, Hannah, your mother, as you, you get me, says like, in half time, all is said and done, blah, 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 blah. This is what the man was saying. So, when I talk about that understanding, that is the understanding that we should use as the defining factor in knowing who our community is. Because we can't fake I have, community. I have, you cannot I have, fake I have, community. If someone loves you, then is a part of your community. If they don't, they are not a part of your community. Because you can't secure people who, who wouldn't secure you back. Straight. You see me? Like, it is, it is like, and if I can, if I can, if, if I can, if I can say, I have 500 people who are going to support everything I do, then I can support everything they do because it's just 500 of them. You get me? But if that, Powerful is, point. if that is 500 million, your life becomes more difficult. Yeah, 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 you end up, you know, you are trying to tell me, say, you have your community that big for you, you know? My community probably is a thousand people. I know that. Everybody else is people who visit the marketplace for X, Y, Z reason and might subscribe to me because I make good products. And they subscribe to me because... Our community. Be be they subscribe because to me because I make good products. And the minute I cease to make good products, they will unsubscribe. You get me? So for them people, my only duty is to come with a good product. But to my community now, them people I get my 100%. You get me? Like, and I saw me deal with it. It's like, you know, me a God, a God give a talent and it's like, it's God give people talent. You know? So if you're born and when you utter certain words, it moves people spiritually, then never you claim no holy for glory for that or not like that, you know? It's because it's the powers where, where, where control farm and then think they were really responsible for to make it possible so we can forward it in our humanity and, and, and express yourself and all of them things. So it's like, you know, when, when and these things I'm not sure, you know, when it all connect back to you know, the whole Web3 thing and all of that, the Web3 is one market space, is, is a new platform for commerce and the transfer of value and all of them things. So, um, is the frame new platforms it is a tool it is a web 3's marking time just like how web 2 marked time exactly you know? it's and like a time saying yo time for us to do things this way now you get me yeah it's just no. simply time for that because the technology is there why not because remember you know we are living off a fiat we are living a fiat militarized currency world and you know and you know people will complain say yo cryptocurrency it's causing um, pollution and it's this and it's not green or whatever, but how much pollution it causes to have a military, you know? How much, how much pollution it causes to have uh, all the different um, interstellar programs that a man have just to have an advantage over a next country and just to have a control over a, a, a large mass of people. You get me? So it's like... And what is the pollution in comparison to poverty? Or in comparison to nations being starved and lack of food, what is the true value of these things? You have people talking yeah. about animals, talking about human rights. So there will always be that. So we have to, again, as you say, yeah. and I'm glad you raised that. That's really what we're trying to build with these conversations, is identifying who our community is. 
so we can identify people and when they realize what it is we represent, then we can now polarize toward each other in more intimate spaces and intimate interactions. Because you cannot, like, you cannot hold on to people. You cannot expect from anyone. You just have to give. You have to give and you have to see how the universe replenishes you. But the moment you begin to know, expect from people, even if it is your community, you know, then that is when you, you, you compromise your ability to receive. So if I am only giving love to you because of the love you will give to me, I don't truly love you. If I need to, pr I need to find a way to practice a love that is unconditional because I practice love. And so for you now to cause me to love you less, you are depleting me and my supply of love because this is not about my relationship with you. This is about my relationship with love. Yeah? Mm. So we look at love beyond mankind. We use words like God, but what we, what we mean by God is not something external, but it's something internal. So if we mm. say God has talent, it means that there is an inborn talent that we have come into this world to manifest and express we are all given talents. Those of us who read the word or those of us who read ancient scripts, it always speaks to those seeds that you are born with, those seeds that you are born from. And how will we manifest it in this world? And how love waters those seeds and makes it manifest in a beautiful way. And when you check out some of the most creative and most talented people, these are people with an exceptional ability to love and even if they have been traumatized and they hide their love away, it is love that inspires us. It is love that brings life. And the more we tap into that as a community and build spaces where it is safe to practice love, then we watch each other flourish. You know, we live in a very competitive world. We are in a very, very cutthroat industry where it is, it looks good to say love, and it looks yeah. good to... But the culture can't catch you, though. Like, we're, we're untouchable. Like, yeah. if, if, if you are dealing with this magic, all right, if you are dealing with the untouchable, man. Untouchable. Like, in, in the music industry, you just come do what you do and, and do what you do. You know what I mean, it's like, it's the same way we treat internet and computer and web tree. Like, I'm an artist, and people will always seek out the highest form of art present in the earth at any given time. You know, some people will even try to wall it back. Some people will wall it back. I've seen where, because remember, you know, music industry is very young, you know. You, 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 we have to accept that, you know. The people who will buy ketchup from, you know, they might make ketchup for like 200 years. People who will buy wine from, they might make wine for 500 years, they might have them wine industry. People who will buy silk from, they might make silk. You have some people who are dealing with silk. <laughs> from the conversation, <laughs> You, 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 you get me? But all I know is what, what you see with music, there is no record company in this world that can say we have been releasing it. 100 years. <laughs> Aaron, you know? So imagine now you have this music industry where it's fresh. Just like how we have NFT and them thing there. The whole concept of releasing a record that was like an NFT in the 1940s, you know, especially coming down like for have your own record, like that is like, how is that even possible? Like, how, how am I going to have someone being able to listen to my performance after me then perform it whenever they want? That is nuts. I saw the man then did I think, brother, if, if brother, if Beethoven <laughs> and their man they did ever know, say, yo iTunes and them thing. <laughs> them probably only get a glimpse of it in the moment when them are make the music. Because I get glimpses of when me in a certain moment of making certain heights of music. And 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 and, 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 and whatever. You get a glimpse of where music are going to be like 200 years from now. You get like little flashes. You know, if, if you ever get in the heights of playing music and whatever, you 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 will get impressions of it. You get me? But... The trans but where we in there any... Now, which part are we there now? Which part are we there right now? 
we see say, if we are make art, and even in the moment we are make art, we can see into what go on. That means uh, just make the highest art, man, and no worry about nothing, man, everything taken care of, man. Just make the highest level of art. No worry about who worth only thing to get into the drugs thing. Because that will make you can see clearly what go on. And then once you can see clearly from whatever drugs are drinking, then that's the one little avenue where a man can really get to shut down your creativity and then thing. But once no one can shut down your creativity and you can go create whenever you want, you're untouchable, man. Trust me, man. You're untouchable. Because if me, if, if me, if me, I maintain a certain type of liberty, because it's out of the liberty the music come. See? Um, it's out of the liberty the music come. And if, when you are live a certain way, you make a certain music, and then the liberty change, and you realize that the music change too. You get me? And then I'm going to say, yo, why you can't make your music sound back like how it used to sound? It's because the liberty change. You get me? So if you can Which maintain a if you can maintain a liberty over a long period of time, right? Only knowing say yo, you only ever seek to advance your liberty, but not to depreciate it or nothing like that. So my music only I got only start. It I just get better and better and better and better. As time pass, it just I get better and better and nicer and sweeter and more harmonic and more universal. And even it I reach to a point where even when someone hear you hum, it sounds symphony. If you just keep the practice up, 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 up. By the time you reach fifty, someone pass and hear you hum and think a three people. You get me? Because you 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 become so at at one with your own resonance and how your voice moves to your body and you know you, you get to manifest be, so, what an artist and a music of, artist really is you see me so in terms of being an artist and a creative and you know increasing upon your liberty right the things that we do to honor our art are the things that we do to honor our temple as well so you have people who have been given exceptional talent and who come into this world and because of the, the, the balance that they were unable to strike with, you know, their mental health, their physical health, it burnt through them. And so all the fire that they came with, they were not able to, to sustain in their physical bodies. And so they left their physical bodies. But they left an indelible and incredible, you know, kind of impression on the world because they gave their all to their art they suffered for their art you know you hear those kind of things so the, yeah. the the real the real the real jewel here is to find a way to balance so that as your fire is burning you are sustaining it so your fire doesn't burn you out so again, I bring it forward because we wrap it up now. I bring it forward to how do we maintain this? This is with this liberty because it's not, you know, a diet. It's a liberty. It's how we balance with our nutrition, how we balance with our breath work. There is a school of thought, an ancient school of thought that says you come into this world with a particular number of breaths. And so the creatures who practice a slow and deep breath live for a longer time than the creatures who breathe and pant very quickly. Like the dog years are much shorter than the sea turtle years. Yeah, we use that as a common example. So when we are thinking about all this mental work and we're doing all of these exercises in our brain and trying to figure out the system, let us not, you know, neglect our physical bodies unless it is we have this, unless it is that we have decided to to burn out, you know? And, you know, we're just going to go through this life and it's going to be short and we're going to just pick up where we left off on the other cycle. But if you want to yeah. have the best of life so that you can have the best experience of yourself and the time to create art and create families and create communities, we have to take better care of ourselves, you know? Yeah, the Man family is the ultimate music still in it. The family and the community is the ultimate music. That's why I said, don't fake your family and don't fake your community. 
just let it be Definitely. what it is and deal with it from it there. Like if my community is a small group of people, then fine, I'll commit to that and they will commit back to me and will grow a community at the at the pace where nature designates or where the creator designates. The Almighty say, yo, what that pace, they chat that pace, they see? Same thing goes to the family. It's like, don't, cause like me, you know what I mean? Like, as I said, we in a space, where we see multiple different people and we get with, I'm very blessed to say, yo, doing music, from a place of love has brought me into a great space with scientists and artists and athletes and all different type of people who are pursued them thing for the same reason. And that to me is how a community is truly formed. It's not out of um to say, oh, um, you know, make we link up out and other reason. It's just like but if we're all doing what we're doing for the same I end, then one way for Formed. I think a community can be formed in the same way that love can happen in any way. Communities have to do with intention. Communities mm. are not formed by, by just because you end up in, you know, the same space or because you, yeah. it, there's an intention behind community. And so you may think, you know what I mean? Somebody might think that, oh, I'm in this awesome community. But the moment, and you said it before, the moment your, your, your value to these particular people shifts, then you're mm -hmm. not going to, they're not going to be your community anymore. So it's yeah. the foundation to be, am I sharing love? How, and what are we calling our community? Because you have different communities as well. You may have one community that is a representation of your culture and your music. And you may have another community that does not have any of those people in it, but they are serving a different purpose so when you are here because there are many of us like for you you have committed yourself to music in a way where that is how you see your art being expressed in the most dominant way for me i am a multidisciplinary artist i am equally a wellness professional educator as i am a musician equally and so yes. the way that i serve i have was ex extends itself beyond just the way that i express my art Right, and in addition to the fact that I am a woman, and as a woman, we come into earth with the with a different level. I of think potential. I think you are an exceptional yeah? so art we singer have... still. Like I think you are an exceptional musician. Like if if I'm to say out of all of the different disciplines, I would say musically you are tapped in, like tapped into a different realm, different, different, different. You know, because like. Let you know, effort like music tap in, tap in, like as it requires. You know, like, when in, like when I listen to your voice, like your voice have a thing in it where it's like he, we can't ever, 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 ever because that them thing not man made. You get me? You mean them thing not man made? Like some things man made. Like we can always go make a good video. We can always go do whatever, you know, but some things, you know, hold on there. Oh, no, there. I mean, I'm screaming, I say, yo. <laughs> so listen, if there, see, this is what happened when I'm on the line with some of my brothers, you know, like, no, I'm not done. But I have, a, I have a, um, Twitter spaces lined up at the top of the hour in four minutes. And we're joining another Twitter space that's talking about NFTs and technology and ganja. And we want to continue the conversation over there. You can tune in and listen in as well because these conversations need to continue, you know? And that's why even when we're on tour, we make sure we make a space for the grounded. So it's not just you come and you see Jana and you try to touch her and tell her everything you ever think about while you try to shake her hand as she goes mm. on the stage, you know? Yeah. At that time... We have a whole other event where we can share and talk and breathe together. And me like when anybody ever talk to me, me make sure we put them in a breathwork and yoga before them even get to talk. Because so many people are in this heightened state that you really have to balance them out, bring them to a zero state, you know, bring down the excitement yeah. so that they think properly.
You know, when we see people, good people, we don't know what they ate in the morning. We don't know the state of them digestive health. We don't know if they're constipated. And constipated people, <laughs> mind different from normal, they laugh like it's a joke. When people have worm in their belly, their mind work different. <laughs> Uh, they need um, uh, the free up laxative I'm man and the dewormer big up pre-scaler should the free up laxative and the dewormer <laughs> Yo, as you take anybody it, no may I tell you me did have worm me did have worm most people some wicked worm man them worm they make it them worm they make it them worm they make you want to drink something with sweet you get me because <laughs> Everyone be like, oh, we eat so sweet and yeah. it is the worm telling you that you love that. That is what the worm love and the worm them in control of your second brain. Because remember, say your stomach is your second brain. You know, and, we have and, a look and, on them thing. I was the watching free of that. the free of laxative and the deworm is the thing them where it is it made them thing that has fixed that. You get me, like. That's what I'm yeah. say, yo, like, in our Black. space, we have some healers, we have some scientists, like, genuine people in our mind. We're not talking about, like, oh, every single healer we meet on the planet, because, you know, we meet enough people, and we meet enough athletes, but me can tell you about some athletes, we uh, can tell you about some man in a Premier League, where the man in a deal with enough flesh, we play Premier League. No flesh. When we go them on the yard, we can just pull them on the fridge and anything we night. You get me? And them on their top Premier League. And them on the, 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 the strong. You get me? So it's like them on the end up, them on the end up become like uh, someone in look, look up to for, for, for when it comes to how you can live a certain way and still excel even in a physical sport like, like football. You get me? Like that. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah, I've, yeah, you, so you, the you know, co 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 for people within the space where, like, like as me, I share, you know, and every pre-scale, like, they're Monday, they're Monday, have some medicine way from, you know. Is it true, you know, come back, you know, say, all for people, you know, I'm big up, you know, say, I try to fit in everybody for me, you know, say, I'm big up. <laughs> I have that big them up because you know them man there. And it's natural. Me can't reason and I big up them man there. And it's just like how me can't reason about Chalice and I big up Janet. Uh, it, it wouldn't be a full reason. Listen, right now, we're going to head over to the Twitter stations. But before we go, we want to make sure that you know, Chalice said, we are building a community. We are building a genuine community, right? 333 spots in this community because... We also practice certain sciences where it comes to the number of them. And this is a manageable number where we know we can touch these people and we can bring forward all of these different healers and these different experts that we know into this space. And to and we have to you can't deny the value of money and value, value delivery. And when you you clear the karma when you spend right and you show that this is what that i mean this i'm going to give something of myself to receive this thing i'm going to be a part of this thing so that i can value it and when you become a part of this community and you get the value added you now feel like you have a responsibility to maintain it because you have spent so you are going to contribute so there becomes this exchange and in this exchange it is going to be determined by what you are willing to put in that is how you get balance from life so for this particular purpose, we're inviting people to be a part of a particular community, yeah? The Chalice Station. And we want Chalice to be able Station. to deliver the value. So we want to be able to, to share in a particular way and hold space for people who are holding space for themselves. We are not going to throw our pearl to swine. We are going to make sure that when we are giving of our energy, we are pouring from the overflow. We're not going to broke our neck. We're not into no savior complex where we're trying to save anybody. We're leading by example, doing the work, and sharing with those who also see value in the work. So, brothers and sisters, we're going to jump over to Twitter right now. So if you're in the space and you want to hear more about this project, you can jump over to the Twitter spaces. We're online with our... Make sure that we... We, 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 you know, we value their time as well by going across right away. So Jamar Chronics, I want yes, you to sir. jump over if you want to hear a little yes, bit sir. more as well, right? We know Jamar Chronics is a big fan. Platform to platform, yeah. 
opportunity to see if he has the time to come over. <laughs> but if you can, please do. You see me? So All join right. us over there. And thank you so much for being a part of part one of this discussion. We're gonna have it. We're gonna have, we have to have more of these spaces. And as the feminine, I feel it is my responsibility to hold space and hold balance to give my brothers an opportunity to speak. Because a lot of times my brothers are misunderstood in this world and marginalized. And we feel like women are the ones who are marginalized and, and the, but trust me, woman powerful. We don't have no problem in the earth. A earth of a so. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna host speak <laughs> them again soon. Uh, I'm gonna move over to Twitter. Uh, and think of everybody that is tuning in. And uh, brethren, mm -hmm. you're gonna make some time to talk to us again soon. Yes? Uh, and here and and what and this. Maybe on Twitter, because Twitter is a very interesting opportunity. All of the 21 people in the chat who want to talk, we can give them an opportunity to talk then. You know? But we we'll love when... we go over this and now? Right in this now? way. No, yeah, we're going over there right now. I'm going to join our chat right now. So come over, yeah, join us on the Twitter. <laughs> yeah, all right? Uh, yeah. So everyone, yeah. big up Kelly so for me. Give Kaya Knight a big hug and kiss from Yo, her. see Mike join. Yo, see Mike join, yo. Mike is here. Mira not drop him, you know, but Mira not drop up him Mike. here. Big up Mike. Mr. Mike. Yo, trust me, man. Big up Mike, man. Big up all I man over there. Yo, me say some crazy people are joining. Wait, but are some top people. Them. I just show their name. Um, no, 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 they're from the team. You see me? Yeah, some man. original uh, people. Big up I Mike. I don't know what me a chronic auntie, so make sure. <laughs> so follow and support. <laughs> I get to learn. So come over to Twitter now. We're joining a space. And we're going to continue to share more about this NFT project because it is about wellness in the Web3 space, right? All of you who have the money and know forget rich and all of that, make sure you know for take care of yourself too. Because you can't take it with you, no. Is it? All right. So link up. Rastafari, big up yourself. Stop, yes. Girl on the cheek. Bless.